Hi, welcome to another Kati V5 video tutorial. Today I want to show you how to make a drawing of a complete assembly. I used this assembly before in some other videos, so it might be helpful if you have the drawings for it as one of my subscribers suggested. So, I need a new drawing. I make it a for ISO and portrait. Okay. Now I'm in the drafting workbench and first I want to make the first sheet of this drawing. This should be an isometric view. Go to the product, select the product and then click on a face or a plane on which you want to view normal. So I take this one with the isometric view this doesn't change so it's okay move it to the middle and maybe I could delete this annotation first page I need another page or sheet so go over here second sheet I want two more views so I need a regular one you could use this one or the advanced front view because here you can change the scale and I want to have it 1 to 2 okay go over to your product select the product and another face for the normal view confirm and you get this one then I need a projected view maybe like this I want to have a bill of material which is in the sheet background so I might change to the sheet background you got two bill of materials I will use the latest one that's the advanced bill of material which has a little back but it will do right now and OK go to the product select the product switch back and just click somewhere on the sheet you got a bill of material I want to change the reported properties so select it and go to the properties and I want to remove this one make sure always press apply after you change something the revision could go as well and maybe the type as well but just make apply and the type as well if you want the new one new you could uh, go right here and change it to material and call it material make sure to press apply because very often it happens that afterwards you cannot change the reported properties okay now I move it up here that's okay right now so go back to the working views and I will add the balloons I will let Katia generate the balloons there might be another problem sometimes it happens but let's check it out so there's generate balloons that's the active view and you got them that's okay right now move it a little bit over here here you could arrange it as you want okay if you want to remove the arrows from the shapes you have to give them some sort of alternate target to jump to because if you try to move it it will always go from one line to another one but not on the part itself but 
in this video we'll leave it on the parts okay that's my second sheet